Hi, boys and girls. I have a surprise for you today. Uh, Mrs. Oliver let the staff run into the school today to get their personal belongings and anything else that they might need. And I got all of the gingerbread books. You guys love these when we read them in December. And I'm going to read, th read them to you all over again. So we always start with the gingerbread man. This is... Um, it just says pictures by Karen Schmidt. Hmm. Once upon a time, there was an old man and an old woman and a little boy. One day, the old woman said to the little boy, I will bake you a gingerbread man. And she did. The old woman put the gingerbread man into the pan, and she put the pan into the oven. Now watch the oven, said the old woman, and when you can smell the gingerbread, call me. But do not open the oven door. Then the old woman went to work in the garden with the old man. The little boy sat in the kitchen and watched the oven. Soon he could smell the gingerbread. I want to see if the gingerbread man looks as good as he smells, said the little boy, and he opened the oven door. The gingerbread man hopped out of the pan. He hopped out of the oven. He ran across the kitchen to the open door. The little boy ran to shut the door, but the gingerbread man ran faster. He ran out the door and down the steps and into the road. Then he called out, run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. Remember that? The little boy ran after him. The old man and the old woman saw the gingerbread man, and they ran too. But the gingerbread man ran faster. And the little boy and the old man and the old woman had to sit down to rest. The gingerbread man ran on. Soon he came to some farmers. Where are you going, shouted the farmers. I have run away from my little boy and an old man and an old woman, and I can run away from you too, said the gingerbread man. Oh, you can, can you, said the farmers, and they dropped their rakes and ran after him. Then the gingerbread man called out, run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. The bear ran fast, but the gingerbread man ran faster, and the bear had to sit down to rest. The gingerbread man ran on. Soon he came to a wolf. Where are you going, shouted the wolf. I have run away from a little boy and an old man and an old woman and three farmers and a bear. And I can run away from you too, said the gingerbread man. Oh, you can, can you, said the wolf. And he began to run after the gingerbread man. Then the gingerbread man called out, run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. The wolf ran fast, but the gingerbread man ran faster. And the wolf had to sit down to rest. You know what's coming up? The gingerbread man ran on. Soon he came to a fox. The fox said, where are you going? I have run away from a little boy and an old man and an old woman and three farmers and a bear and a wolf. And I can run away from you too, said the gingerbread man. Do you remember what happens? The fox said, I can't hear you, gingerbread man. Come a little closer. The gingerbread man stopped running. He came a little closer to the fox. Then he called out, I have run away from a little boy and an old man and an old woman and three farmers and a bear and a wolf. And I can run away from you too.
I can't hear you, said the fox. Come a little closer. The gingerbread man came very close to the fox. Then he shouted, I have run away from a little boy and an old man and an old woman and three farmers and a bear and a wolf and I can run away from you too. Oh, you can, can you? Said the fox. And snip snap, he opened his mouth and he closed his mouth. And that was the end of the gingerbread man. The end. He shouldn't have gotten that close. Until next time, and I have a whole bunch of gingerbread man, boy, and other stories. Bye.